Hello, my amazing people. I greet you according to your time. If it is your first time and you like what we are doing here, kindly subscribe. Put on your notification bell. To all notifications is very, very important because it will enable you to know when we upload a new video. Here we react to all forms of videos. We educate, we inform the members of the public about what is happening. And to you, YouTube, I appreciate you for creating this wonderful platform that we are using to disseminate information. At the same time, I put a disclaimer that here in Linda's TV show, we do not promote violence, we do not promote hate speech, we do not promote misleading information. Rather, we are here to educate, inform the members of the public and also to remind you to that a call for self-determination is never a call for war. Every country in the world have this. The government recently said that Simon Eba must be arrested. That is the, the illegitimate governor of Abia State. When he assume office, I want to elaborate some certain things. When he assume office, a lot of people praise him. Oh, the best governor, coast governor, corner governor, panic governor. Some of you, we are praising him. What did I tell you people? Have you forgotten the shock of Mwike? A lot of you are actually praising him. There is nobody that assumes office as governor in Nigeria that assumed the office to serve you. They assume the office to serve the Nigeria, which is the platform where they assume the governor for. Not because of you. Do they assume governor because of you? Do any one of them know you? Even some of them doesn't even need certificate. They don't need anything to assume governor. Just go to North and do her Kadede. They will give them governor. And then they will come. You will praise them. Oh, he won on the platform of labor. He won. Some of you who we are against the P2B, we are actually praising offspring of P2B, which is the governor of uh, uh, Abia states. Say, so oh, a fine governor, good governor. They praise him. They said 24 hours power supply in Abia State. Till today, have you gotten the 24 hours calm that they promise you? Oh, he built a dam in not less than one year. 24 hours power supply. Have you gotten that nonsense called 24 hours power scam? They are now telling you, oh, a lot of people are really sabotaging it as a chief security of the state. You know those who are sabotaging you from building a 24 hours power scam in Nigeria. You know them, and you couldn't arrest them. Your problem have now become Simon Eba. Are you not having psychiatric problem? In that 24 hours power scam. Many of you here praise him, oh my governor, oh he did a very wonderful job. Which job? If I ask most of you, which, what did he do to become a wonderful job? You can't say. And those of you who are ignorant of the politics of Nigeria, we are praising him. Oh, he's doing marvelously well in Abia State. Why the entire labor is doing what they are doing for politics of, they said, 2027. They are doing politics. You see, 2027 politics. They said, they we are doing what they we are doing. Because of 2027 politics, and some of you, we are actually praising them. Oh, my governor, you are really trying. My governor, you are really trying. My corner governor, my bending governor. Those of you that are praising him. And through the back door, he placed him on a back. Are you aware that he, he placed, he ordered them to arrest Simon Eba? The same other state, we are the people that prepare condolence. Is it condolence this thing to write, read that, oh, how much Nam the Kano died? The condolence, we are already in the, on, on the table of, is it all Jose Okalo? What is the name of the governor then? Is it all Jose Okalo? It was already on the table of the former governor. Then, to read to the people, Condoleez visit. 
Is the voice coming out now? To read to the people, Condoleez visit. I have 84 live views, only 30 people hitting the like button. To read to the people, Condoleez visit. Uh, Condoleez this thing against Mazi. And luckily to, them, luckily to us, God disappointed them. Okay. Okay. Okay, not Oti. All the same. Someone is as redirecting me. Now I can see the news, please. Not Oti. But uh, all the same. No governor in Nigeria must be trusted. They said he's the illegitimate governor. Mba. I have seen Mba's own, and that is the reason why I use Mba's picture. But I thought that Oti was among. I said, let me start from Oti to Mba. Come, Adam Solomon. If you are here for politics, Chineke Bogoko, do you think that I came here for politics? Do you think that I came here to, for politics? The same Abia State, we are, we are, we are, we are this thing. Mm, uh, uh, is it not the same Abia State that wrote Condoleez visit to Onyendu? Is it not? Is it not the same Abia State that those of you praise? 24 hours of power supply. Have you gotten the 24 hours scam? Have you gotten it? Oh, go and read it. Go and read it. Your brain in the freedom, your body in the in Nigerian politics. Ndoshi. Come on, get out. Whether you like it or not, he's still a scam. They said the illegitimate governor, the land snatching. I have talked about Enugu State many times. Many of the news that I got from that Enugu, I have shared it, played it. Many of the videos, we had a clear ground for Fulani to build their cattle ranch. Did they clear ground for Fulani to build cattle ranch in Enugu state? I told you people that they have given them Ruga. Ruga is in Enugu. I have done the program. I don't even uh, know that it was the same Enugu. Don't blame me. Blame my brain. But all of them are still the same. Whether in Uguabia, they are still the same. The same criminals. The same thing. The same ohi. It only takes a time before you know and understand where it where is coming out from. This platform goes a long way. Even the even the governor, other state might you be here. Listening, this very platform goes a long way. It is called True Views TV. I preach the truth. Let the people and my audience know it is not the Abia State Governor who. Uh -uh. It is not the Abia State Governor who demanded for the arrest, please. And I will correct the headline. I will correct the headline immediately after this very program. It is. The Enugu state governor, the illegitimate governor, the Opian Wunyam model of Enugu state. Many times I have shown you people the evidence on my table. The evidence on my table. Consigning the governor, previously I have countlessly said about him. I have countlessly talked about him. Which is the governor of Enugu State. How he gave land. You see, too, the people of Eziago, that uh, four corner side, somebody did video how he gave land. With one chinenye, there, one man called chinenye, Nazar Hawan, that wants to marry the daughter of IBB. 
which brought the Fulani into their village. And even Fulani is now among Gomunna. Because if you call the village, the villagers will come to meet him. The Fulani will be in the meeting. Somebody videoed the, the, the land when they were clearing it to me and showed to me, which I have played here. How they, they, they are conquering the indigenous of Enugu State. This is the problem today. I don't know what to do. How they are conquering the indigenous of Enugu State, snatching their land, giving to the Fulani. I have played it here, time without number. And today, the governor of Enugu State, don't forget, it is the DOS, the criminals in DOS, who jubilated about him, who approved him, whom he gave money, who praised, them on, uh, praised him on Radio Biafra. Now he is placing Mazin Simon Epa wanted. The same wanted, they placed Mazin Nam Dekano. And the criminals in DOS told you, oh, we are fighting for the release of Mazin Nam Dekano. But can they arrest Simon first so that they will release man? Eh? Do you see how criminal all these things look? All of them looks too criminal. All of them looks too criminal. They are not being sincere to what they need. Towards the Biafra that they claim that they are fighting for. They are not being sincere. If the governors claim that they are not the ones that hold on and do, why are they looking for Simon Eba? And there is something that they said. They are now using the governor of an uh, illegitimate governor of Enugu State to speak about it, to demand for him wanted. There is something that they said before. They said, don't release Mazen Nam Dekano if Simon is not been is not gotten. Because if you release him, it will be fire to fire. According to them, it was the governor's successor that nobody should release Mazen Nam Dekano unless Simon is gotten. Unless Simon is termed. And according to Iberibe, Senator Iberibe, he said that Part of the condition of Mazen Namdekano includes he will not speak about anyone, which means those in the criminal DOS sold him. He can't speak about them. He can't, uh, uh, he will come out and condemn Simon immediately. But they said that the modus operandi of Mazen Namdekano is different. But they want Mazen Namdekano to condemn Simon. And that same thing is their stand, all the governors, including the illegitimate governor of uh, Abia State. All of them are illegitimate. There is no governor that represents the people. Otherwise, as a governor, you speak up. As a governor, you talk. All of them will always play the card. We are fighting to release Mazen Namdekan. Immediately, they assume office. <laughs> Who is fighting to release Mazi? You won't hear anything again. They will be dribbling you like a JJ Okocha and Kano Wanko. They will be playing you table tennis on your head. You cannot and dare not hear anything again. Immediately they assume office. The stand, I want all of you who are watching me to know the stand of the governor of Enugu State is the stand of all the whole governors. B.T. State, Anambra State, uh, Ebony State, uh, Abia State, uh, River State, Delta State, Ihenile State, all of them, it is their stand. The current situation in Nigeria, they enjoy it. At least they pay them suffering allowance. The more people suffer, the more they increase their own suffering allowance. Wardrobe allowance, clothes allowance, uh, laughing allowance, entertainment allowance, newspaper allowance, fuel allowance, car maintenance allowance, uh, 
girlfriend allowance, that is refreshment. Refreshment allowance. The more the people suffer, the more they benefit. So if you are among them, will you ask for Biafra to come? Knowing fully well that Biafra is not going to entertain a criminal entity. All of them are in the same circle. And that is the reason why when I see people, people like me can't praise any governor, no matter who he is. Cannot praise him. If you have a red flag for me, the same way all of you praise the governor of Abia State, they said the 24 hours power supply, have you gotten the 24 hours power supply? Upon all your publicity, have you gotten about it? Oh, he's doing the road. The road is for, for what are they calling it? To use it for campaign. Obi, to use it for campaign. 20, 20 what campaign? What can you say that you are enjoying in one Nigeria? What can you say that is the benefit of one Nigeria that you are getting? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Nothing is your benefit. You are benefiting nothing from one Nigeria. And yet, you support them. But I want every governor, all these illegitimate governors, to know that there is no time in life that people cop their faith by themselves and you conquer them on the platter of Anakoaka. You cannot. 113 live views. One hundred and thirteen live views. There is no time that uh, you will, uh, the people have been conquered. They have used media to rubbish Mazen Namdekan. First, when the other barrister was in charge, he said Mazen Namdekan is now having score score. And most of you believe that nonsense. He is now having score score. Secondly, they said, oh, Mazen Namdekani is begging that he will accept any condition. Yet, they come back to tell you that part of the condition that they want is that Mazen Namdekani must come outside to condemn Simon Eba, which he had not, which he dare not, which he cannot. What have even they done? I want all of you to know the stand of the illegitimate governor of Enugu State is the stand of all of them. They said Simon Eba must be gotten, arrested. They declared him wanted. The same Ohanese, they declared him wanted. They thought he's Mazen Namdekano. They declared him wanted. They placed a bounty. Today, what change? Nothing changed. Nothing at all change from where we are today. Oh, we need him. He's wanted. Uh, oh, we need him. He's wanted. For what? They said he's destroying Nigeria. Is Simon Epatulumbu that entered the, the office of the president with a forged certificate as a drug lord? All of them know that who is leading Nigeria is a Chicago drug lord in Nigeria. A Chicago drug lord in Nigeria. All of them know that. Or don't they know? But yet they applaud him. Yet they praise him. Yet they wanted him just because of the fear of hate of Igbo man. But what is baffling me is even the evil man that is being hated is even hurting himself. You are being hated in Nigeria for taking your faith. You that is being hated is even hurting your own self. To the tune that you can place your enemies in order to accept, in order to sell your brother for the fear of Nchonchego. How much can you get in the rubbish called One Nigeria? How much can they give you? Simon Eba wanted. 
they made a lot a whole lot of noise. The same people who made a whole lot of noise, Mazen Namdekan is the is the evil. Mazen Namdekan, after the kidnapping of Mazen Namdekan, all of them turned to Promazi. The same way they could have done if Mazen Namdekan they buy Mazen Namdekan. This is the same way they could have been pretending to you as if they love Mazen Namdekan. Is it not? This is the same way they will be pretending to you as if they love Mazen Namdekan. Now they kidnapped him. They couldn't succeed. Simon takes over. They started what they started doing for Mazen Namdekan against Simon. And now pretending, oh, Mazen Namdekan is more civil. If he were civil, why did you go to Kenya to kidnap him? A civil man, an understanding man, the man that never fought for freedom the same way Simon is fighting, yet you went to Kenya to kidnap that man. He is not a warmonger. He is a civil man. Why did you go to Kenya to kidnap a civil man? Why? If it were to be Mazen Namdekan, this sit at home would have been stopped because he would not continue it. Yet you kept him in DSS. And now be looking to, for time on it. But we have told you people countless of times release Mazen Namdekan. If you do not release Mazen Namdekan, the people will, will never, ever listen to anybody. Release him, let him be free. Let him go to Finland and confront Simon Eber. We agree that Simon Eber is evil. Yes, we support Mazin Namdekano to stop Simon. Let Mazin Namdekano, that Mazin Namdekano, that all of course, you have agreed that you are supporting Mazin. Me, I have agreed that I'm supporting Mazin. Let us support the Mazin Namdekano to go to Finland to confront Simon Eber, who is evil. Who is not evil? Am I communicating here? Am I communicating? Simon Ebi is self-proclaimed. Yes, all of you are keeping sleepless nights. Nobody voted for him. 45 million Biafrans have voted for Biafra referendum. 45 million Biafrans have voted for Biafra referendum. And yet, nobody voted for Simon Ebi. 45 million Biafrans have voted for Biafra referendum. Nobody gave Simon a mandate. Yet, 45 million Biafrans said yes, we gave him mandate. Now that all of you are now supporting Mazen Namdekano, as we are supporting him, but the difference is that you help Simon to support Mazi. Okay, what will happen now is that we will support you people that we also will help Simon Eber. But allow Mazi to come out and go to Finland to confront Simon Eber. He needed to be confronted. Yes, Simon Eber needed to be confronted. Governor Mba, am I speaking in your favor? Please remember that uh, uh, our money is, uh, is it, uh, 50 Naira recharge card. Uh -huh. After speaking in your own favor, you will send 50 Naira recharge card because that is the normal amount that they are being paid. 50 Naira recharge card. And they will answer Hanka Dede, Hanka Dede. They will ask how much is bag of cement. And they will go to their Twitter to say, oh, to, uh, cement is very high, yo. Cement is very high. Governor Mba, I have now become one of your fans. Governor Mba of Enugu State, Imane Oremitus have become one of your fans, but on this condition, that you people must release Mazen Namdekano, sponsor him to go to Finland, that Simon ever needed to be confronted. Let us tell the Finnish government that Simon e is not representing us. By releasing Mazen Namdekano, for him to go to uh, uh, Finland, it's not all as if climbing on uh, this thing, Making a useless decree, Simon Eber wanted. Ohaneze have done that. They put 100 million. Ab initial. And that time, dollar was how much? By now, they should increase the money now. Nah? They should increase it to 1 billion dollars. 
Because all of you know how many million dollars you spent to kidnap Mazen Namdekano. They should increase the deal. Ohanese, the criminal Ohanese, especially the one, what is, what is his name? The Otokoto Ritual Killer Syndicate, who claimed to be old man and crepo when going for Mazen Namdekano's bell. But not old man and crepo when going to Abuja to discuss how to sell his people. He will be in Abuja, not old man and crepo. But to talk about Mazen Namdekano, you know that I am old man and crepo. But, but to talk about how to sell your people, you are not old man and crepo. Ndoshi, 21st century 419ers, 145 live views, only 83 hitting the like button. 21st century Ndoshi. Others hit the like button, please. 21st century Indochi. Looking for whom to deceive. In the name of uh, one Nigerian lies. You can no longer deceive all of us. Not none of us. I, Emane Oremi Jews, will support the governor of Enugu State. That Simon ever needed to be confronted, but the governor, what you will do is to release Mazin Namdekano to go to Finland to confront Simon Eba. Minus that thing, minus that condition, whatever that you people are talking is rubbish. Everyone in this platform, I hope you people are supporting the view that we have agreed. According to what they are saying, let them stop making noise. Simon Eba evil. Simon Eba this. Mazin Namdekan is more civil. Mazin Namdekan is more politically. Poly. Poly. Umwene Olehane, she has seen Oibo. Mazin Namdekan is more this. Mazin Namdekan is more that. Simon Eba is a criminal. Simon Eba is a criminal. Simon Eba is raising this thing. Yet they keep Mazin Namdekan, who is more civil, under their care. Can we then support the motion? Governor Mba of Enugu State, please, we now come to you on a clean and plain mind. Can you tell the government, all the governors, to go and release Mazen Namdekano? Take him to Finland to confront Simon. All of you knew we listened to Mazen Namdekano. <laughs> they said Mazen Namdekan is not violent. Mazen Namdekan is more modest. Mazen yet they went to Kenya to kidnap him. And now hold him to tell us, look at the brainwash. Hold him in communicado. 154 live views. Only 93 hitting the like button. Can I see those of them that have not hit the like button to hit the like button? Hold Mazen Namdekan in communicado. Only to turn around to tell us who are the followers of Mazen Namdekano. That Mazen Namdekano is a very good man. Yet he is still inside DSS dungeon. The court pronounced that they should release him. Yet those who are telling you that Mazen Namdekano is a good man is still holding that good man. Only to turn around to say that Simon Ebi is a believer for demanding that Mazen Namdekano should be released. And they are telling you that Mazin Namdekano is the most civil person ever done freedom fighting. That he is not a violent person. That he is cool and modest. Yet, whenever they say release Mazin Namdekano, you will see all of them crying. Hey, you want to release him where Simon Eba is? Somebody that we have begged come out to the camera to condemn Simon. He refused. How do you want to release him? Don't release him. Uh, if you release him, it is a double tragedy. Yet, they tell us that he is more civil than Simon Eba. I don't know. I am no longer understanding anything. I am beginning to get confused in the way and manner which they publish their own news. I am a freedom fighter. Mazen Namdekar's follower. 
Mas ele não me deu nos trolou. All of us. Mas ele não me deu nos trolou. Because he have the moral and the zeal. Condemn Simon? No, I wouldn't. Or if you do not condemn him, you can't, you can't be free. What about those people telling you, oh, as far as I'm concerned, and now, Mazen Nam the Kano will come out. When they see that there is tension, they will go and use Mazen Nam the Kano to cool it. When people now cool down to look for them to do that thing which they are now saying, they will leave it. You remember there was tension. They bring the Mazen Nam the Kano issue. Okay, all of us are on it now. Let nobody do anything. They were preparing for bullets then. Now they have gone down to the people to tempt them, to bring them down, so that they can say, they can stand on what they want. And anytime you see them fail, they will come up. It is a game. They are playing their games very well. Anytime you see them failing in this game that they are playing, you will see them rushing out, saying, oh, can we release Mazen Namdekan? He's a good man. Let everybody stay. Political tension, corner tension, bending tension, corner, figure. Let nobody, oh, we are now on it. Mazen Namdekan will be out from 2023. They have been using Mazen Namdekan will be out the next edition to play you game. 2021, I mean to say, to date, haven't they played the game enough for the illegitimate governor of Enugu State to say that Mazen Namdekano should, should be arrested? When, they, when you hear them saying arrested, what is in their mind is to buy. What is in their mind is to destroy. Not the arrest that you know that they are. They are using political wars. Is that not the same words that they use during Python dance? Oh, we are preparing to Python dance. And people said they are preparing to go to Mazen Namdekano's house. They say no. That this exercise, they have been doing it even though we don't know where they are doing it. They prepare for their python dance. They said it's in other states. They we are going to Mazen Namdekano's house. People we are raising alarm. The army ogre was saying, oh, it is a lie, yo, that people should cool the tension. People are lying, trying to bring the tension up, that there is no such thing, that this uh, military exercise, Ndami have been doing it. At the end of the day, it was in that Mazen Namdekano's house that they did it. You see, no, you see the same Nigeria that all of you want to support. Nigeria of lying. Pastors lying. Adeboye lying. All of them in Nigeria. If, tell me any single pastor that is not known with lie. Unless the juju that they are using in you is working. You will never know that they are lying. Tell me one single one of them. If you know that one that is not lying, just tell that one that Ebel Damini is at the back of his gates. You will see that one will take race. Show me one single one of them. The God told me. Me and God communicate. Yet the people are suffering in your church. And you and God communicate. God cannot do it when you are communicating with him. Show me one single innocent. That is the reason why that country is suffering. Your religious leaders are being used to tell you. All the religious leaders in Nigeria are criminals. Quote, quote and read my lips. They will come and attack this very program. But all of them are criminals. Show me one single one of them. We are they not the people that told you, oh, Muslim, Muslim ticket. They can stop. They, it can happen. Oh, this is not a banana republic. There is can. Oh, don't say what it is not. It's not obtainable. We are there today. We are there. The drug lord used Archbishop of Ndi Kekemaruwana, Archbishop of Ndi Mechanic, in order to pursue all of them. Where is your can today? Where is your daddy Adeboye that he always drink tea with God? Where is he today? Your daddy Adeboye that tells God the temperature, cool it down. Where is Umar Bai 
that uh, goes to bank when there is no money in his account and tell them that uh, God uh, speaks to him. There must be in the money in the account and there is money and they will pay him. All of you listening to lies in that contraption, they use your religious leaders. All these things that you are seeing, these shenanigans, was, uh, what are they calling him? The Bishop of Ubuntu, the Catholic Bishop of Enugu State, Onaga, who hired a native doctor to run a propaganda against a reverend father called Mbaka. Onaga. Was he not the same person who banned and started suffering AGK member for saying, I bless my as in Nam de Kano. I bless my as in Nam de Kano. Become problem from the church, in the church. The blessing of God, their God, have people that have it. Ndoshi. Okwam Gwimperimpa, Anaga Catholic Church. Anaga Catholic. Aneri. The evil that is happening to you, it doesn't concern your religious leaders. It doesn't concern your religious leaders. And the most important, the most painful one is that when you speak about these criminals, religious leaders, you will see those that their evil is burning. They will come and defend them. Mr. Man that is defending a pastor that is living in mansions is still struggling to get money to enter Keke Marwa, but will be in every platform defending those who milking him, those who dining and whining with the government of the day. Jesus Christ never dined and whined with the government. He made sure that the government, Zacchaeus, which is Ndonoto, fared back. It is because of your, the stand of your religious leaders. That is the reason why most of you suffer today. Don't you know that? It is because of them. Martin Luther Jr. joined the people, fought against uh, perpetual bondage. Martin Luther fought for the benefit of the people. But what have your criminals who are going about? They dine with the governors. They tell them, oh, go and preach. Preach someone that will make people to cool down. They use them to quell you them. They will come to their congregation and tell you something like this. Last, yesterday, I was thinking about this protest and the sufferings of Nigeria. God told me that there is, so, uh, there, there is sin in Nigeria. I, God, is the one that allowed it. So it is not all about political leaders. It is what God allowed. You need a restitution. Pray over your sin. You will see you go. Hey! You will hear. Iki, 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 Iki. Ikaba, Ikaba, Ikaba. When I see the, this nonsense happening in Nigeria, when I see your religious leaders, I look at them and as the senior devil, because the devil, you know, is the junior one. Your religious leaders, not even all about uh, Peter Mba, not even all about uh, 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 governor of uh, Imo State, not even all about uh, the governor of Abia State, not even uh, all about the governor of uh, Nandem. It is all about these criminals who allow them. They hide, they hide. We are among, when they started this nonsense, the, your religious leaders, we are they not among the people that they said they visited Onyendu, and Onyendu gave them the, the message that Onyendu cannot give himself. We are they not? They use religious leaders and traditional leaders, traditional religious leaders, They use them to lie and to confuse those of you. And today, when you argue, you argue like Onye Shinike, we pushing share the whole pipe on You argue like 
um, done B. Show me. I am Emmanuel Oremikus. The message that I preach here is some diluted truth. And you must share anytime you see this very program. As of the headline, I will correct the headline. But one thing I want all of you to know is that Amram comes sunshine. Freedom of the people is sacrosanct. Freedom doesn't call for killing. Freedom doesn't call for spilling of blood of any type. Why is the Nigerian government spilling the blood of innocent? This, they will always tell you, just like uh, Hamas, just like Ndobu uh, Ishiala, they always change the narrative. They will always tell you something like this. That uh, it is because these people are criminals, wielding arms. That is the reason why the security operatives have now want to stop them, that you cannot wield arms. Now you go and ask them, 2015, did anybody wield arms? The answer is no. Why did you kill them? 2016, did anybody wield arms? The answer is no. Why did you kill them? 2016, did anybody, uh, 2017, did anybody wield arms? No. Why did you kill them? 2018, 2019, 2020, December to official 2021 till date was when it all changed. Was when it all changed. So if you say that, oh, it is because they are wielding arm. When you went to the house of the leader of indigenous people of Biafra, was anybody wielding arms? The answer is no. Why did you go there to kill them? Why? Why? Why did you go there to kill them? Why? You can't find any answer. Because lies and deceit is what I see. Can you buy the letters I see? And leave you to argue like a moral, moral, which most of you are. You go out to argue like a moral. I am a man of religious, and the message that I preach here is undiluted gospel of Elohim Chukwokukabiama. And from me, from here, with the love in my heart, I wish you good well. I wish you good luck, and I wish you good. Keep on sharing this very program. Hit the like button in order to support this very program. And if you wish to support this very program, you can do it on YouTube here through Super Chat. It's the only way. Till I come your way next time. Remain blessed. Thank you so much for sticking to this video to the end. Like I said before, now it's time for us to go to the comment section to air our mind and our opinion. Say what you think about this video and this platform. Do it constructively. Share this video. Like, subscribe, and also continue to watch Linda's TV show because this is the home of news. Until I see you again in my next video. Remain blessed for now. I would say bye-bye.